blindness could be cured via cellular rejuvenation by the end of this year. It would be crazy, but could happen. We could see a huge step forward for David Sinclair's information theory of aging. If you need a quick refresher. Aging is essentially scratches on a compact disc that makes the music skip. And eventually cells, by reading the wrong genes, skipping the wrong genes, lose their ability to fight against disease. They lose their function. We get dementia, we get heart disease, we get cancer, we get frailty. That is aging. And if that's true, is, there, is it possible to reset these structures back to being young? Is there a backup copy of the epigenome? In other words, can you polish that CD and get back the original music of our youth? How do we polish the discs? How do we reboot our epigenome's hard drive? Sinclair has spent the last few years working on various experiments to help unlock the evidence for his anti-aging thesis. But one specific area where he's been successful has been using epigenetic reprogramming to heal the optic nerve and cure blindness. So the concept seemed to work on paper, then it worked on mice, and then it worked on monkeys. So what's next? I don't see any obstacle currently why we shouldn't be um, asking for volunteers who are blind um, as early as um, this time next year. And when was that clip from? May of 2024. So last spring, he said, this time next year, which makes it this spring, 2025. More importantly, if Sinclair's trial shows that it's possible to reset human DNA to a more youthful state, and that continues to hold true with other cell types, that means this year in 2025, we will be on a clear path to stop aging on the cellular level.